ignore the fact that I look like a unicorn just barfed on me, but like, no, just no. Oh, that kind of hurt. Hi guys, it's Sadie. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's so like most teens, I've been browsing through TikTok literally the majority of my day. Like I swear, I have nothing better to do apart from browse through the many, many TikToks that come up on my For You page. But while I am browsing through the For You page, I've come across a few TikToks showing people's like really, really cool aesthetic photo walls. And I was like, yo, it's kind of dope. So we're gonna make one. Yay! So today's video, I'm basically just going to be showing you how I make this photo wall. Let's go! So this is my room. Hold on, let's fix this. That's better. So I have this wall. It's pretty empty. So I'm gonna just p cover this in photos. So last night I went onto Pinterest and I compiled a bunch of different really aesthetic photos that I liked and I put them all into a Pinterest board so all I need to do is download these and then we'll be on to the next step. So all I need to do now is put these kind of into a collage and put them out on photo paper. So let's go. Then I'm downloading all of my photos into a website called Canva, where I'll then lay out them onto an A4 sheet, ready to print. Due to being in quarantine, I can't really go out and get them like printed, so I do have this photo paper that I can put in my own printer. I'm sorry, mom, in advance for the ink. I don't know how many sheets I'm gonna need, so I'm just gonna put like the whole thing in. I hate the way it feels. Ugh. Disgusting. So now I just have to print all the photos that I've put together and then we can get to putting them on my wall. So yay. While they're printing, I'm gonna go outside for a swim. So I've printed majority of the photos out on photo paper. I didn't do all of them because the ink was like starting to get low and that was a bit worrying. I'm gonna cut these out and start to kind of plan out how I want to kind of collage them on the floor. See, the print job started to get like really bad at the end. I'm already bored. So I've kind of planned it out a bit and I've gotten it to what I roughly really like. So now all I need to do is put it up there. I'm just gonna take a photo of it so I can make sure I have it in the right position when I'm putting it up. This is really hard. Take a short break, but we're nearly done. Oh, 
Okay, so I chose to not include this one photo, so we'll just chuck that to the side. But, uh, I have a bit more blue tack left, so I'm just going to use this blue tack to kind of pin down any of, like, the flopping up sides. I've run out of blue tack and I need more, so we're going to go, like, ravage the house for blue tack. Thank you so much for watching. I'm really, really happy with the result. It looks like great. I'm, I love it. And maybe one day I'll expand it to be the full wall. But for now, I actually really like it. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I know it was a bit sporadic, but it's really fun to make and it was a good way to pass time in quarantine. So if you're interested in doing that, um, yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. <laughs> Bye.